Sick Grandpa live out here tonight. <laughs> it's Tuesday night here in Bahal. An Aussie farming in the Philippines did a restaurant review there. And he said it was the greatest food he's ever eaten in the Philippines. <laughs> and he goes to a steak and seafood restaurant, right? And uh, the best food in the Philippines he's ever had, he ordered a pad thai at a steak and seafood restaurant, which probably costs, you know, less than a dollar to make. And of course, you know, he had to notify the restaurant on Facebook that he was coming so they could have the entire stuff ready for his channel. Of course, that it has nobody watching it. I mean, he has nobody watching it. Nobody cares what the Aussie and the farming in the Philippines does. Nobody cares about his content. Nobody cares about his e-bagging bullshit. Anyway, so he goes to this restaurant, right? And uh, the steak and seafood restaurant. <laughs> and then the staff's like falling over themselves trying to help, you know, the e-begging midget around. And then the e-begging midget, you know, of course has to invite some other foreigner to, of course, pay the tab. <laughs> I mean, of course, of course. You think the e-begging midget could afford food out? <laughs> I mean, and then, and then they show, they finally show the pad tied. It looks like dog food bro i mean all the greatest food the ebay midgets ever eaten in the philippines looks like dog food bro and then they take a look at it in that video man it's like a brown you know a brown soup with noodles on top <laughs> I mean, that's not pad thai bro that's dog food aussie farming the philippines failing at every moment <laughs> loser